Hey guys, and welcome back to the channel. Brand new series, The Invincible, based on the book by Stanislav, Stanislav Lem. I, I, terrible pronunciation, I'm sure I butchered it. I, I don't know about this book, but I do know of uh, some of his other more famous works, such as Solaris. So uh, that's good. Let's get going. Hey, my name's Twitchy. Brand new game, totally blind to it. Uh, I hear it's a beautiful, hard sci fi adventure. The Dragonfly, a small research unit of the interplanetary Con Commonwealth, with a crew of six, travels t into the distance regions of space. I didn't know we were going to be doing a, uh, a comic book at the beginning. After visiting many worlds and exploring numerous planets, the research mission comes to an end. However, on the way home, there's one more task waiting for the crew. Despite the risk, Astrogator Novik <laughs> underestimates the extraction, uh, undertakes the extraction of a rare and extremely valuable mineral himself. Novik gets the mineral, but, cost, uh, but at the cost of a broken leg and immense pain. Not just a little bit of pain, immense pain. The Astrogator's accident doesn't stop the crew from happily celebrating the end of the research cycle. It was a time of creating deep bonds and feelings of unstoppable. Bonus. <laughs> it's a Polish, Polish game. Polish game. Uh, victorious, they set a course for home and go for a well-deserved rest in the hibernation chambers. It's where it's where I like to travel in space. Is the hibernation chambers? If not, you got a long way to travel at sublight speed. Not about. Why am I seeing the sky? Where am I? Where am I? What's going on? Why am I not in the stasis pod? We we went we went to bed. Hello. Anybody? Can we look up? Look down? Do I click the button? Movement. W. Okay, we're, do we're doing the thing. We're doing the thing. So, hello, I am in an orange spacesuit. How, how are we in an orange spacesuit? And seriously, like last I knew, I was just in my underwear. We were getting in the cryo tanks. Uh, hello? Uh, what, what, what have we got? Help, are you there? How do I, how do I select? Oh, the mouse wheel. Okay. Help, are you there? Corville, Merritt, uh, yes, and to base. I have a uh, just My friends. I think I would like to see my friends. Uh, how do I, that one? Hello? Is anyone there? Anybody? Uh, Corville? Marit? Someone. Anybody. Hey, this is Yasna. Yasna. I was just with you. And now, I don't know where I am. Or how I got here. Is this physical reality? Am I dreaming? I've got a splitting headache. Oh, I don't like splitting headaches. Also, my visor seems quite Does anyone hear short. me? Base, do you copy? Are you there? I don't think base is around. Where, where, what, what base? Like seriously, what what base is she asking for here? It's probably nothing serious. What? No damage to the suit or bone structure. Okay, I'm good and my does, suit's good. That's fine. Does headache? Well, I've come out of I've come out of cryo sleep too heavy, right? Ooh, ooh, ooh. What what was what's that? Hello? Can I can I click this? Can we can we take it? Can we have a look inside. Survival pack? Maybe. I would hope so. I would hope so. Yeah, we're gonna click that again. Turns out I gotta look at the thing that I want to interact with. What a retro looking communication system. Who has like chunky wires like this going on? Hello? Hello? Uh, press the space button. Uh, oh, oh, uh, this is a multi. But uh, uh, are you there? I can't hear you. I can't hear you anymore. My receiver worked for a moment, but now there's only silence. Oh no! I should have gone. Hello, is there anybody there? I should. I should have gone with anybody there. Ah, oh, there's going to be some like quick thinking, decision making on the, uh, the dialogue. It turns out. I'm a little bit worried about that. No beacon. Oxygen levels. I have two solid hectobars in the tank. That's enough for several hours. Hectobar. What's a hectobar? That's my beacon. Where is it? Like I assume, you know, like bar, like pressure for the atmosphere. But hecto? I, I don't know. I don't know. What have we got in here? We've got ourselves food supplies. That's nice. And something. This looks more important. What? What have we got? Is it a tricorder? Maybe. Maybe. Hello. Hello. Can Can we interact with this? Just like I thought. Nothing. 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 I'm on my own. Terrifying. The beacon can't be detected either. What beacon? The be it's gone. It's gone. Let's click that and be good, right? Uh, I mean, we could, we could, we could eat some food rations, but I think I'm okay. I mean, the the headache's not going to go away oh, with the food rations. The past right? me hasn't failed the present me. Okay, what are we looking at? And let's hope she took notes. We, we seem to like. Is this a map? Is this? I think map description. Are we in Regis three. Doesn't ring any bells. Regis three. My crew have no way to tell me. 
So I report that I have no recollection of this planet. The last thing I remember. Hang on. We've closed the research cycle. Yes. We, we were already in hibernation. Flying back. Indeed. Is my blackout a side effect of metabolic depression? That would be bizarre. So there's like this route. I, I assume I'm here, landing spot. I don't know. Who, who knows? I could be at one of these far away points. Let's uh, let's read this marching routes thing. For some reason. For some reason. Split into two Why would we do that? The first one set up camp. I wonder if I was with them. Oh, am I on my way there? Have I got lost? I mean, I don't know. Landing spot. Both groups landed in the same. Place. That's helpful. Could we look in closer? Okay, this is good. Map that gets updated as I look. Two landers to the surface. They usually do this. Maybe the first one broke. Maybe, maybe. Let's have a look in here. See what else we've got to look at. Over here, is this someone moving? No, no, no. There was a little bit of a weirdness there, the but it's okay. Group explore the ocean with no biologist. That's weird. That's very weird. And the other one, just me. Just you. Took a different route. We should go find the other crew. Definitely go and find the other crew. Can I click? I can't click that. Let's change the page again. Leading to. Leading to. Where are we going? Let me know. Let me know. Camp. Right. I was heading straight to the camp. I, I assume. I mean, how, I just woke up. I don't know what's going on. Must be somewhere near. Must I? Must I? Give me a sign. Give me a sign. Send up a flare. The probe. Anything. Look it around. Okay. I'm gonna head to the camp. But I'll be keeping an eye out for you. I still don't know who our mysterious stranger well is. Well done, past me. <laughs> he didn't disappoint after all. Landmarks. Oh, these oh, things. I sound like... I need to stop doing this. Find your exact location. So we've got Needle, Dog, and Croco. <laughs> Let's look at hey, the Croco. Crocodile. Where are you? Oh, what, what is this? Have I only got one eye? It, it looks like I'm about to put it up to what I... Oh, hey, what, what have we got? Well, that if that's not the needle, I don't know what is. But I'm going to look at this one because that looks like crocodile, right? La landmark, can we look? Uh, focus, WSD. Ooh, whoa, okay. We, so W to zoom in, uh, S to zoom out. What's the distance marker? Oh, it's the it's the, um, the focal range, if you will. Okay, that's good. Um that has an interesting shape of a crocodile indeed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, nom, nom, nom. Look at the face. Look at the face. Uh, surely we can all see the face. So if that's yeah, crocodile... One. Oh, one. I'm, I'm... Oh, okay. I get it. I've, all right. That, this, is, this is very clever. This is very clever. You see this, this curved line here? It's the point that's so far away from... The, I can't look up at the thing. From from Crocker. I took a distance measurement. Okay, that that's An very cool. I called needle. It would have been better if they got me to do that, but I suppose that's not gaming, is it? So Croco, if, th if this one's not needle, I'm going to be very surprised. So look, we got we got distance around the outside line, right? And then if I like focus on this, right. it gives us the it 150 or whatever. I, I can then put that curve on on the map. Look, here it goes. Bam! I, I, we, we already I know I where I am. My position. Time to hit the road. If I wanted a, a height measurement, I'd, I'd also have to get a third one involved. But you know, I don't want a height measurement, so we're just using 2D 2D uh, geometry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is geometry. How far away is a circle and stuff like that. I, I, really, I, I don't know if you guys are aware of this. I should imagine so. But most people here been with the channel for a while but I'm a, I'm a studying astrophysicist I'm currently at uni uh, doing such wonderful things dragonfly <gasps> I think I see our ship it's not moving why is it not moving you're not leaving without me are you no no li literally why is it not moving things can't be in orbit unless they're moving why are you holding up there uh, okay I, I, I guess we're just going this way right the, the the place looked like it was through here device what device are we looking at? More dropped equipment. Can I pick it up? I must have hit the ground pretty hard. Is, th is this a crash site? This here? Is that is that a thing I did? Can I pick this up? A metal detector. Ooh. How do we use it? How, how does one detect the metals? Dr. Gorski, you won't be pleased. More equipment to repair. The detector's dead. Oh no, uh, why would I need I'm taking it. I guess I shouldn't just leave it like this. No, no I, I, mean, or not. I can't be littering a pristine environment. So I just want to go and look back at where I landed here, right? You know, I, I, I've hit the floor 
pretty hard for some reason. I cannot sprint for very long at all. Uh, I've hit the floor pretty hard for some reason. I'm just wondering if there is any any sort of indication as to what why why I land. What what did I fall out of? Why have I landed here? I want to get out. The sun is pretty hot. Um, okay, I'm not seeing anything that gives me any. Oh, that's nice. Dog over there. Look, look, here is a dog. You got ear, mouth. Oh, that's, that's amazing. Is this like a hammerhead shark? That's that. That's what I'm going with. Okay, we 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 gonna have to be moving. Uh, is sprint on a toggle or is it a hold to sprint? It looks like it might be hold to sprint. This looks like an interesting way. I've got a feeling that this is now a game of exploration. Uh, I'm going to be looking up some, some side paths here. This is what I do. I'm in a canyon. Yeah. I'm in a canyon, which doesn't make it easy to navigate. No. I hope the data's trustworthy and you're close by. Can I use the climbing rope? Is this a thing? Hmm. I think that's my rope. How did we... It didn't just fall out of the backpack, so... Apparently, I didn't have time to collect it before I fell. Uh, fell. Did you fall? Is that what happened? Can, can I use the climbing rope? Is that is that a thing? Or am I just gonna? Are we are we, are we just gonna put it down? I kind of wanted to go up there, but okay, all right, fine, we'll take this. It'll be fun. I, I, I really want to know about my backstory, my history, how I came to be unconscious on a planet when I thought I fell asleep in the cryo tank. Uh, we 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 got we got some problems here. We got some problems here. It's good to know where I came in, though. It's good to know. Can I jump? I do not have a jump. Okay, that that's that's fine. Uh, it's always an interesting one to discover in games whether you can or cannot jump. Oh, does that look terrifying to you? What a huh. reservoir. There's water on this desert planet. Unknown liquid. Hmm. Another liquid that did not allow the biosynosis to form. Biosynosis? To replenish drinking supplies. What's a biosynosis? Filtration, as we all remember. Third row. Oh, flashback. Some, something happened. Hello? Yeah, Koval, how's it going? So far, so good. Have you checked on Yasna? I was about to. Hello. Goodbye. Is it? Is it all fine? Are we good? Already awake. Good. Oh yeah, but I feel rough. Oh, I could do something. My mind is still in hibernation. Why do I? Um. Yeah. Yasna. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know if you're awake or whether it's a post-hibernation apraxia. No, I'm. I'm awake. I'm here. I'm, I'm awake. good. Just slowly. I'm alive. Now. Try to get up slowly. Dr. Gorski doesn't look so well. How are you holding up, Gorski? Don't get up just yet. Who's it's Gorski? It's really so hard for you to remember a couple of simple rules. I have to stretch my legs. They're numb. Hibernation will do that. Just sit for a while. There's a thing over here. I can also get up. Okay, let's do this. If he's getting up, I'm getting up. I am a strong, independent woman, and if a man can do something, then I'm going to go and do it yeah. as well. Take it and remember. The third rule. The third rule? Yes, I know. Stay hydrated. What's the first two? Two small sips. Am I, am I supposed to not wait? How come you're so up? Always the first one to get up. I don't know how you do it, Murray. Practice. It's a matter of habit. Yeah. After so many cycles of cryogenic sleep, one either gets used to it or becomes a tortoise. We'll go with that one. Can I become a tortoise? I, I feel like tortoises have a good time. They run around on those little skateboards. Have you seen them? They're cool. They're Hubble, cool. will you help me here? Car, let's let's get going. Sure, I'm Try coming. not to throw up as we do it. This is not our system. What? Has anyone noticed we're in the wrong place? Kovel, it's not a good time. Yasna, look for yourself. This is not the right planet. This is not way. You shouldn't be walking. I yet. couldn't think Come of on. anything more terrifying, actually. Waking up after hypersleep, expecting it? to be I'm somewhere. I'm telling you, we woke up in the wrong place. Yes, we heard you. But it's not going to help right Enough now. Of this, Yasna. Astrogator. Debating chamber in 15 minutes. Debating chamber? I'm down for the debating chamber. What's the X? I'm going to press the X. Oh, we've got ourselves a new thing. Okay. Uh, Dragonfly on route. We, we did this one already. We did the dragon. Uh, the R Rages 3? Uh, Rigel 3 issue. Oh, we're looking. We've seen things wrong. Lost. 
Oh, this is this. Is good. Oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. We got, we got word. The Dragonfly crew is awakened from their hibernation in emergency mode after the ship comes close to a mysterious planet, Regis Three. Despite their evident concerns, Novik doesn't immediately reveal the details of the unexpected mission. Okay. Uh, Yasna, Yasna, the dragon, uh, Dragonfly's astrobiologist. I'm the astrobiologist. Wakes up all alone, disorientated, and. Uh, uh, amnesic uh, in unfamiliar place. She hopes that someone still receive her messages despite the connectivity issues. Yasna discovers that she is on a desert planet called Rigus 3. Wanting to learn more, she heads to a nearby camp of her crew. Along the way, she manages to find scattered equipment, including a metal detector that she hardly ever uses. Wait, so I'm supposed to use that a bit more often? Okay, oh, I mean, that's, that's cool. To find out. But first, here, what? hold on to it and remember. Remember... Rule three, small sips. I'm back, I'm back. Doctor? Oh, of course, Doctor. You wouldn't, you wouldn't send a not Doctor to this type of stuff, right? Uh, what is that? Should, can, I, can I just jump down this way? Looks like I can, looks like I can. Hello, how's it going? So I need, I need to get down there to refuel, right? Tra tracker? T? Hello, how you doing? Oh, I have something on the tracker. I assume it's no one from the crew, so perhaps it's my beacon. So over that way, use tracker to find the beacon. I will do that, but like, I just I saw something over here, right? How do I put the tracker away? Uh, I don't, I don't care for the tracker right now. No, it's like, no, you will use the tracker right now. Okay, we'll, we'll use the tracker right now. It's, it's definitely th there. That you see, pointing with the aerial, pointing at that that rock there. Is that where we're supposed to be looking, or looking at the the water? Is it my my face, or is it the tracker that's pointing? The, these are questions that we need to ask. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and run down there. Look, there's a there's another hole and stuff over there. Though I do, I really would like to get some more liquids if I can. Rule three, I uh, it's not it's not to be not a male dingle dangle. It is to go. Sorry, that's a Discord joke there. Rule three in our Discord. Be nice to each other, man. Be nice. Uh, but rule three, get get hydration. That's that's what we're looking for. Getting hydration. I. Also, want to go look up here. This is this is going to be quite the exploration episode. I can tell. Are we going to be able to find any mysteries? Are we going to find any dead bodies lying around? These are questions. I feel like this is the way to leave. Do you feel like this is the way to leave? I feel like this is the way to leave. I'm not going that way. Let's let's see if we can jump over the edge of the rock. I got a feeling it's not going to let me. Yeah. Okay. All right. That's fine. I'm gonna I'm gonna walk down the slope. Oh look footprints coming up the slope. I wonder who they could belong to. Uh, okay, so we've gone around the corner. Uh, I mean, we were up there. I've come back down. Uh, and I'm going to go look at the, the liquid over this way. Oh, 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 oh. There's, a, there's a thing. There's a thing. Do I care about the tracker more than that? I, I might. I might. Look, this, this liquid over here, though, this is what we were supposed to be looking at with the... Um, dare, dare I walk into it? Am I safe? Safe. I don't know. I don't know whether this is safety liquids or not. I'm, I'm just gonna walk out on the other side. Did, was that good? Did I clean my boots? Is, is everything fine? All right. Let, let's go and find whatever this tracker is pointing at. The beacon does uh, reside over in that direction somewhere. Oh, hello. Is that, is that a press here to walk up over the side? Okay, that, that's fine. We can, we can make use of that. Uh, is it just leading me back to the metal detector? I can see. Oh, okay, so the, the, that's a nice little tracking interface. I like that. I like that a lot. Okay, we got a beacon. We got a beacon. It took us a while to find it. Got you. I found it. We did find it. I mean, it was good times. Good times. Look for me on your trackers. Okay, now, now I'm just the, the middle person. Okay, that, that's fine. We're going to put the tracker away. Uh, I, I guess if we're finding the way to camp... Can I pull my map up? I can pull my map up. Uh, we want to go uh, between dog and needle, okay? So we, we've got... That's croc. Okay, must be that way? I was walking under croc. Where I was, so what was over there? Wait a... Mm. Okay, look, there, there's Croc, and there, there's the hole that I walked back from. Hmm, hmm, interesting. Oh, I, I can just turn the pages here. Okay, that, that, that's a thing. It's not really what I wanted to do. Uh, I, I guess I'm just, I'm off on an explore. Oh, oh, what's this? Oh, oh, this is a, this is a big, big hole here, and I'm not sure if we can exit from the area. That's nice. What was the other one? Uh, this. This. All right. No time to lose. I found a way out of the valley, leading more or less towards the camp. Oh man! But how do we? But how? How do we get out? 
I, I, I feel like I'm missing stuff. I feel like I should go and check. Oh, I can't. I can't go that way. I can't go this way. Can I not like throw my climbing rope up there? Is that is that not a thing? Okay, let's go. Let's go and check out the uh, the croc area because that. The, well, I don't know. I'm, I'm tempted just to follow the wall round now. I'm tempted just to follow the wall round. There's Croco. Okay, that's that's cool. That's cool. It's, what? Why is that over there? Because hmm. trying to think which way we've come up and which way we've Time come down. Go. Got a little disorientated. Just a, just a little bit here. Look at that star. Oh my gosh. That that is some some solar prominence. It like oh, bottom left, top right, and then it's all like sun spotty in the in the other areas. That's nice. That's nice. Uh, okay, can we go this way? No, this do this doesn't look right. This hmm, does it? Does it not? Uh, I think it does not. It's an interesting area. Oh, oh, I found I, th I found uh, an invisible wall. I mean, they've done pretty well so far at not using invisible walls to hurt me. So I suppose just finding the one looking around in such ways is okay. I am actually going to have to walk back up the way I've come from, aren't I? But look, look at this. So that little corner in the croc. Uh, is indeed the way that we were supposed to be going. All right, th th here we are again. Wow, deja vu. It play it plays heavy on me sometimes. It plays heavy. There's needle, nice. I I'm feeling the pounding heat of that su sun. Uh, I don't know about you. Oh, well, star. I, I, pres I presume it's Rigus, right? They name name the the planets after the, the thing. If if we were naming the Earth. The same way we name exoplanets, this would be Sol 3. Which is kind of... Well, it actually depends on the order that we discover them. So, like, Jupiter would be Sol 1. Volcanic area. Mm. If this area is volcanically active, ash outbursts and extreme temperature changes may explain the extinction of local fauna and flora. But it's all just too idyllic. There's no dust in the air. The sky is clear. And the soil looks like laterite to me. I don't know laterite. It's not highly fertile, but not entirely barren. I mean, it, it feels like stone everywhere. On some planets, such storms last for several hundred days. Like Mars. It's not one of them. It could well be. It could Oh, chasm. Oh, the bottom's out of sight. Yes, yeah, so, well, that's why we wear trousers. Uh, okay, so if I mean indeed, look the the Actually, bot. How far up am I? The only intriguing thing about this place is that there's almost nothing to research. Yeah, like where's the moss? What are you doing here? Where's the lichen? Where where's the like the microbial film across everywhere where the water does decide to collect? I mean, th these are what I would expect to find on a you know non. Uh, non-civilized planet. Oh my god, look at the size of that crater. Well, that's huge. Uh, that's a big big rock hit, hit here at some point. Big rock. Continue marching towards the camp. I mean, that. What, what do you think I'm doing? I'm also being a tourist, thank you very much. I find myself on a brand new planet. Do you, do you not think that it's time to stop and look over and be like, how does it sustain a, 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 a dust? Look, there's more big craters. I feel like they just copy and pasted it's mounting out a few times. Uh, we're not going to look at that. We're going we're gonna to walk away. We're, gonna, we're not supposed to notice these things. <laughs> uh, okay, so there's a... Is that the way I'm supposed to explore first and then find a dead... Oh, that, 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 that's a pass through. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to explore this way first because it feels less deadly. Uh, let's go down here. Um, and of course, it is just a feeling. Who knows? I could very well, could very well be walking into a giant trap laid down by sand monsters. So that that's there. Okay, that that's cool. That's the way I could have come in if I walked down first. Uh, nice that they give me options. I, I have no idea if those options are meaningful options, but you know they are options. So that's that's a good. Don't normally get them in most games. Hmm. What about the bright sun? Is that is that a song? I'm gonna press the Z button. They want me to do a thing. What am I looking at? What are we looking at? Tents. I can already see the camp. Over 400 meters in a straight line. 400. 
I see you. Can you hear me? Oh, it's half a click. No, no worries. No what? Oh, escape is not the button that we want right there. Uh, okay, so they can't. They can't hear me. F. F. F is the button. I want. Uh, okay. I just need to get down from here. Am I? Am I too high up? Is that? Well, there's the edge. Okay, that's that's cool. There's another edge over there. I, I just want to like look over the edge. Storm at strongest. Oh well. If it catches me, so be it. Yeah, that, like that's just life. Hold. I mean, who doesn't want to go walking out in a sandstone vertical drop? Do I want to go check out the vertical drop? Or do I want to hide Oh, I'm tempting, tempting. I've got a feeling that this is going to be not the way to go. But let's try it. Let's try it. Oh, vertical drop. I can't get down this way. Ah. But I can secure the rope. Is that what this is about? Well, should we go check the other side before we do that? If this just gives me a way of climbing down without using my, my rope, I would prefer that. Here the ground slopes a little more gently, which doesn't mean it's completely flat. No, nah. no, nah, it ain't completely flat. Uh, I'll, t I'll take my chance. All right. I want to see you as soon as possible. I'll take your chance. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. What, what could possibly go wrong? <laughs> I say, on a on a crazy planet. All right, you just got to keep running. Oh, 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 oh. This is not how I would have chosen to go down there. Why did she not just run? <laughs> like, just turn around. Yeah, a slope like that. Oh, that was less than ideal. Woo! Trying to reach a crew as soon as possible. Uh, Yasana takes ex excessive risk, which could easily lead to her mutilation or death. All right. But I'm okay. I will I'll bear that in mind. I will bear that in mind. We, we will no longer do that. How far away can I use this? Hello. Oh. Ooh. 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 I think we need to bring the focus in and out. That, that, that's too short. And then we go this way. I, I want to know how far away the planet is. It won't let me. It won't let me. It's like, no. Oh, oh, there we go. Visibility could be better. Wait, what's happening? Oh, no. Ah, oh, I was trying to look Maybe at the planet. And then suddenly... Should I wait? I don't know. I don't know whether I could... This is the way to go. I don't know how I'm going to know whether I'm going in the, the right direction or not. There's there's not a great deal of landmarks or things to see. Of course, I am just going to push up. The fact that I've already knocked my mouse when I just wanted to walk in a straight line doesn't seem great for me. Can I run? Can I run? No, I can't run. Things are... Ooh, blacking, are we blacking out? Go oh, blackout. Boom. What happened? The, the wind? The wind was too much for me? Could be. Was that was that a death? No, not death. I'm all right. I'm okay. I'm fine. Are, you, are we fine? I feel fine. Are you okay? I feel like maybe. What happened? What happened? Where? Are... What's going on? I'm so unsure right now. The head injury appears to be serious. Yazana blacks out again. No, my face. Okay, that's that's fine. That's fine. I mean, it's not fine. It's terrible. This is not the situation where you find yourself in. But I think the camp was over that way, right? I was heading to... To camp? Yeah, to camp. Impossible. Impossible. I'm much closer to my destination. I must have walked for some time. Can we turn around and have a look? I don't remember. Is this going to happen a lot? Out again. Are we, are we going to just like wake up in new places all the time? Let's turn around. I don't recognise any of this. I don't know where we are or what we're doing or how we even get there. All I know is I want to get to my camp and hopefully we'll see things. Uh, I need to get back to the travel fly. Come for me. Hi. I'm so close. Yet in my condition. Every step. They all hurt. They all hurt. I don't want to whine, but if you come here, it will be so much easier for me. Like, so much easier. Could you imagine having to walk all the way over there? This is this is not the... Like, I want to go up that way. Why am I going deeper? This seems like a terrible plan. I mean, we go... We're going the way we're allowed to go, I suppose. But, like, terrible, terrible battle. Sorry, I saw this little nook here. Yeah, no, it's not going to let me in. It's not that type of game, unfortunately. But it's a good, it's 
good. All right. Um, what, are we, what, what are we gonna find ahead? Let's move with a little bit more purpose, a little bit more speed, uh, and maybe we can find oh, this little push-up button here. Nice, nice. Hopefully, we're gonna find some crew. Uh, I, I will take an android at this point. I don't know whether this game has androids or whether they think they're too fanciful because this is this is a hard sci-fi game, as we have mentioned in the past, which means we're not like no faster than light travel, no no stuff like that. We're sticking within within the realms of physics. Uh, which which I'm I'm a fan a uh, fan of. Are you singing again? No 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 no. We like the bright sun. We keep the bright sun. The I th I feel like this is not really the surface to be climbing up without having tested stuff first. You know you know what I'm saying. Any one of these rocks could like look at that crack back there. <laughs> I I feel like they're all gonna like just fall down on top of me, and then we're in trouble. But I have scaled a cliff. It's not that scary. It is. It is. Celestial body. What do we, what do we say about I remember you. Hey? Regis third satellite. R303. Okay. I mean, that's cool. Oh, we're having a flashback. More flashbacks. Oh, what's going on? Help. Hello? Astrogator, sir. Crew. Dr. Gorski. Right Any updates? We have a set of data from the near surface probe. Great. What's going on then? Let me know. Let's read the report, shall we? How's the activity? Zero, zero, and two. Of so what? Less than nothing. Atmosphere? Nitrogen, 78%. Argon, 2%. Carbon dioxide, zero. Methane, 4%. The rest but is wait, oxygen. That's 16%. With oxygen concentration as such, there should be life. Yeah, where'd the oxygen come from? At least some microbes, and yet we have detected no traces. Yeah, we'll get to that later. Let's finish with the probe readings first. Air radioactivity? It's virtually zero. In the word of paradise. No radioactivity, no endospores, no bacteria, no mold, no viruses, nothing. Just the oxygen. Crazy. If there were no living organisms on the continent, there shouldn't be this Should've much Should have all rusted out. What if life develops on some other continents here? No, I doubt it. Insulation outside the equatorial zone is weak. You don't see how thick the polar ice caps were, don't you? I can guarantee a minimum of five miles of ice sheet, potentially six. Mm, that's true. There's more chance of something in the ocean. Some seaweed, algae. But why didn't life migrate to the land? Why? It could be because of hard radiation. Mm, I don't think so. According to the probe readings, the ground activity is exceptionally low for this part of the galaxy. I wonder if some special kind of drought-intolerant evolution occurred here. And that would at least explain some of the abnormalities. Some of them. Hmm. Anyway, we'll have to take a look under the water. First, it would be good to know what time frame we're working with. For what? T time frame for what? what? What are we on about here? Marit, do you have the geological analysis? Conclusions, but this planet looks old to me. Such a fossilized egg must be at least six billion years old. Wow. Besides, the sun has seen better days too. It's almost a red dwarf. Any rare resources, forms, creatures? We can't expect such detailed data, sir. Not from this distance. Yes, we would have to explore the surface. Astrogator, what exactly are we looking for? The value of this planet. For now, it may seem like the pinnacle of nonsense. I assure you that Regis 3 is not without war. Why, why do you think that? What have you possibly got to set base that on? Also, what's that sun has taken a beat in Red Dwarf Astrogator. business? That's not how suns work. I have the impression you're not telling us everything. As always, Dr. Koval, your instincts are correct. Please forgive my reticence. My goal was to maintain unimpeded research neutrality. There is indeed a very important factor of interest in this planet. Yeah. The Alliance. The Alliance. Not the Alliance. Correct. What do they have to do with it? Well, they've sent their most powerful unit. Unit? But to our best knowledge, Condor's traversing a distant quadrant. Well, I'm not talking about the Condor. So, the Invincible. Ooh. Good guess, Doctor. She said the name. A steel behemoth with the power to produce billions of kilowatts in a split second. Converting it into energy fields that no material body can penetrate. Concentrating it into destructive rays as hot as stars that can reduce a mountain range to dust or evaporate an ocean. Together with its crew of almost a hundred men. Professionals that are neither better nor worse than us. 
Well, I dare to say we're better trained, Astrogator. Uh. They are, however, unquestionable masters of propaganda. I know that some accomplishments they brag about are very much far-fetched. But the capabilities of the Invincible are not subject to doubt. And we as the scientific body should sever ourselves from the emotional and symbolic facade. In other words, we cannot ignore facts just because we don't like them, Mr. Coven. All right. But where do we stand in all this, together with our, may I say, not quite as numerous staff? Despite our modest forces, we still have a chance to gain a critical advantage over the Alliance yeah. while avoiding confrontation. Okay, uh, and how would we do that? With Simple. what? We leave this planet before the Invincible arrives here. Which is when, exactly? Well, they're still far away. <laughs> Astrogator, please, how much time do we have to conduct safe research? 13 days. Seems all shady. There's no time to lose, then. I appreciate your eagerness, Cove. Dr. Crowther, do we need full gear? Mm -hmm. Definitely. Also, I caution you against taking off your helmets for a prolonged duration. This amount of methane is not neutral. Breathing the local atmosphere will lead to saturation drop. And you may start showing symptoms of mild brain damage, feel stupefied. But uh, don't worry, not before an hour or even a couple of hours. I see. Dr. Gorski, will you program Artie to collect samples? Of course. Marit, Krauter, please prepare for the surface. Koval, you too. You're leaving early in the morning. And what about me? Yeah. You're staying on board, Doctor. But Astrogator... Uh, this is not up for debate. I need you here. As you well know, there's not much work to do for a biologist on Regis 3. If any. Find stuff to do, surely. Oh, look, I only just saw the celestial body out the window. That's what triggered the flashback. to stay. What the hell am I doing here? Why am I here? What is even going on? Press forwards again. Okay. Oh, I sat on the side. Oh, that's cute. What a, what a great... Great time to just sit there and be like, hmm, what's going on? Find a way to the camp. I'm trying to find a way to the camp. Surely this is the way to the camp. I, I don't know what else. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, thank goodness. That we've got someone. Not everyone's in the field. Uh, well, I mean, it's a beacon. Doesn't mean that that's a person, you know. This is Doctor Yasna reporting. Do you copy? Hello. Do you, do you read me? I'm entering the campgrounds. Oh. Is anyone I told there? you I'd take an Android. Hello. Oh, it's just an Android bot. I'll take one. Thank you, Tracker. Put that away. Hey, 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 mate. Android bot. And Android bot. Dude, my friend. Uh, lead me to the crew. Android bot. Guide me to the nearest crew member. This is like you are. Android bot. Guide two people. Android bot. Locate human. Hmm. Damn. Can't do it. Is that what we're saying? What, what is this? Hello? What have we got in the in the in the sand here? Have a look. Oh, it's a picture of all of us. Oh, that's really nice. And then this side, uh, they were working on the Astrobot. Okay. And then the the habitation. Cr well, well, okay, that's that, that's fine. That's that's a lot of stuff. Uh, Dr. Gorski, have you made changes to the Androbot's algorithms <laughs> without telling anyone? <laughs> Again. Hello, RT. Oh, uh -huh. uh, well. Never mind. Never mind. Let's have a look here. What can, what can we do with this? Hey there, beautiful. How are you doing? No, just, just like that. Okay, robot ID? Oh, uh, maybe if I... RT, default position. What does that do? I don't know what's wrong with you, buddy, but you clearly don't want to cooperate. Clearly. What am I going to do with his arm? I... Oh. I'm a little worried. Are you okay? Is, is, is everything okay? I, I think we're just going to leave this one for a moment. I've, I've seen that there is a door over here. Are we just... Are we literally crawling? <gasps> Hi. Why have you got your your helmet off? Dr. Crowther. Didn't you hear me earlier? Are you okay? Doctor. Is everything all right? You all right? Do we... Hey. Doctor. Oh, I don't know about touching please. him. Look at me. 
Let's see. I report that I've located Dr. Crowter. He's in bad shape. I'm going to examine him now. I'm going to examine? What are we going to do with the examination? Hello? Um, how, how, how do I do that? Excuse me. Yes, sir. Can you hear me? Astrogator. Oh, my gosh. Finally. I've been listening to you for two hours now. My receiver is dead. No need to explain yourself, Doctor. I know everything. Do you? The transmitter was still working, so I heard your report. Oh, good work. Glad you didn't lose your head. Wait, please. I need to reconnect. Okay, what are we reconnecting with? What? Hey? This? Can I use it? Is this now mine? What is going on here? I, I'm, I'm, I'm a little Testing. weirded out. One, two, three. Ah, copy you, Doctor. Loud and, Loud clear, and clear. But to the point, as I understand it, there's only Dr. Crowther at the camp. And he's not well. No. Ready. What happened to him? I, I was just about to examine him. What's he got here? Dr. Crowther, please don't be startled. I need to take your hand. What are we going to see? Temperature normal. Pulse too. I'm not taking a pulse through that, sure. O2 saturation is fine. There's nothing physically wrong with the doctor. No, but what about, you know, elsewise? Oh, he doesn't like the light. His pupils respond properly. Look at my finger. No delay in reactions. Yet no response to verbal communication. None at all. None. Conclusions, doctor. His brain's been wiped. Both mental illness and serious bodily injury could contribute to this condition. Yeah, really? However, he wasn't suffering from any disorders. And there's nothing wrong with him physically. Epileptic seizure and chronic diseases can also be ruled out. So what? He's just fine? On the contrary. Something is very wrong with him and I can't figure out what. Which is even more worrying. I'll prepare the infirmary. Thank you. But first things first, the lander. The lander? What? We need to get you all on board. Okay. What should I do? Please look for the mission log. It should include crucial data about the crew's activities. We have three more people to find. And you still need to designate a place for the landing. Okay, finding a mission log. Where where are we even going to look? I mean, it's, it's got to be through here, right? It's got to be through here. Can I press the button and see... Finally, what we can see. It's looking good. Hello? Anybody? A anyone else here? That, that goes outside. I found Dr. Crowther. Don't go outside. Um, what's the clicking noise? A little bit worried. This. All right, mission log. Any anywhere, anywhere. It's going to be around here. So look, look at this right here. This is what we're looking for. Dr. Crowther, how are you doing? Can we see what you've got? Um, Initial analysis of the samples reveal nickel, iron, mag manganese, beryllium, and titanium in the composition. I would give a lot to understand what it actually is. A quick theory. A giant nickel-iron meteor splashed into the atmosphere of Rigers 3, melting its surface millions of years ago. No, wait, scratch that. The shapes of the cut structures contradict it. Okay. All right, that's the thing. F, 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 F. A mission log, but it will do. Dr. Crowther kept records. Meticulous I mean, as always. some panicky what stuff. We've got Gorski coordinates and what is this? What, what 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 does that say? What is that? I can't. Oh, right. the coordinates. Yes. The most important thing is probably the landing coordinates. B A twenty three sixteen. Noting three sixteen. Excellent. I'm uploading the data. Yeah. Has that gone onto my map now? Hmm. Dr. Gorski Why? has moved away from the research sector to the west. Ah, that's right. He followed those deposits of metal. Metal? That's why we have detectors. Correct. Mine died, but Crowther had one as well, didn't he? Okay, all right. I guess we put this down. It's the same stuff again. All right, yeah, cool. I guess we just put this down. Stuff's been added to my map. Look, it's right here. Are you looking? It's like right here, right here. Yeah, just a sec. Got it. Okay, it looks like sure it I'm... Works. What for? I don't understand why it wouldn't. It's a rather reliable piece of equipment. Like everything around, and it's already broken. Relay. Okay, it looks like <laughs> we got everything. 
Do we need to like click on stuff or is this just Okay. Checked. Am I'm I? leaving the tent. Am I am I? Uh, I wanna go check on my friend, right? Is that is that not what I wanna do? I'm gonna go just make sure he's okay. If he's still um uncommunicative is the one I'm gonna go with, uh then we will leave him here. Uh, like, he's not died yet, right? Hello? Yeah, no, he's not, he's not dead yet. Uh, I'm going to go the way that it expected us to go, which I think is out this door over here. Um, but also, I think with that, I am going to say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure, ladies and gentlemen. I will see you guys next time. We're going to continue exploring this rather weird world. We're going to find out what happened to the camp, where the landing site is, what we can do with right. the robot. Now for the robot. It's unresponsive. <laughs> Yes, I know. But I'll see you then when we're going to do that. Bye!